Ahoj! Omega Chaos si regan. Ich war da du ein Biff Omega Chaos Episode. This time I'm doing with rank up 8 Akis Dragons. And also this time I'm on Yu-Gi-Oh! for instead of Tepro, because I'm also trying to test out uh, the seventh pun. It's a real powerful rank magic. Since my opponent is playing Dragon Rulers. Even though they are supposed to be pretty much dead. And it's Dragon Shrine. And also sorry that I didn't do a touring video in last week, but I tried to do it uh, several times, but the tours were, were really terrible and I wasn't really feeling well as well, so yeah, sorry for that. But I'm now trying to keep up with the regular schedule. So yeah. And also I hope you have been enjoying my Saga of the Seven Balian Empress series. So, let's see. First I'm going to activate the Seal of Convocation. Unfortunately, a Yu-Gi-Oh! Bro kinda lags a bit when I'm recording. Yeah, he's going to get that Tempest back. I'm going to search out the Attic Seal. Or trade in. Jack the Train. Discard the Attic Seal. And then draw two cards. Hmm, this is pretty interesting. I think I'm going to just set the Mass Dragon. Then. The change chain and end my turn. I definitely like this deck. Of course, this was the guy showed in my first episode of my saga of the Sand by Anniversaries. Which, which is based around uh, the Barian Emperor missile. Okay, someone's out Tempest. Interesting. And White Stone. So I guess we'll go for the Light Synchro. I guess. And it's screen of later. I don't think it, it affects me too much because I can... When attacks into my mass dragon I can just... Summon out Parsec and then just normal summon Heliosphere. I might use mass dragon's effect. Then we need to get out. Power sect in Shelteral Dragon. Set one. Interesting. So, I'm going to... Normal summon. Yes, with Supreme Shell Dragon. And actually, this card might be even good in my Blue Eyes deck. So I might even add it to my Blue Eyes deck when it comes out in Primal Origin. Hmm. To summon. I think I might to summon out. Keep up that. Junk Linda. Just to. Get it out of Crimson later. Because I really don't like that card. 
because I'm kind of weak to it. Then, let's see the chaos number I need to summon. Hmm. Either Ultima Trainer or. Well, I think we go for Ultima Trainer this time. I think I like draw the card. It was so annoying. Of course, my opponent saw this card, so oh well. Chaos Sexies, because the ultimate area is screwed in that aspect that the hit can't be targeted by card effects and, and it's. Uh, other effect also works on any with any Xyz monster. It's just really nice. Oh, it's dark hole. I look kind of expected. Someone on hot. Dragon Ruler, that's fine. I guess Dragon Rulers are not, are not completely dead. But I think the new version is kinda inconsistent. Oh, it's. I'm just gonna space it. just lost my Swarm Warning. And there's another White Stone. Stardust Spark Dragon. Just think. Okay, I get twenty five hundred damage. And now it's my turn. Hmm. I think I'm going to just pass someone definite. Then tribute to definite, and then some other set. Then definite effect like which. Gets me the blue eyes on the deck. Then eight to suspect. Comes level eight. Then I go can go for rank eight summon. See what can summon here? Hmm. Yeah, I kind of want to do this. This will be so my spot, my stop part. Oh well. Can summon number four six Dragon. Going to get Arsene Cosmos from a graveyard to my hand. And then I'm going to just steal that Star Spark Dragon. Some is going to be very angry about this, I think. And then yes, I don't cost was on Dragon. Someone not now can access Dark and Dragon, the chaos number one or son. 
Activate effect. Activate surface screen. But I'm not sure if that helps. Maybe only if it activates the battle fader or something. But I think we'll attack. I think this game. And yes, this was game. So, I guess we can go for next well. And we are back. Next well with rank up 8 Axis Dragons, which is a deck I created for Saga of the Seven Point Emperor series. And I actually really love this deck. Oh, it's a freaking Swider deck. Seems. No, I don't want to play against that, so it's a surrender and go for next duel. And I'm back again. I definitely don't like when people play Swider decks, but especially when I'm actually doing a dueling video. That makes it annoying. Hmm. And you straight in. Got the Parsec. Then I'll take the down trading. This got the blue eyes. Hmm. That's interesting. I think I'm going to activate Silva's Cry. Get out my blue eyes white again. Yes, I run blue eyes because, of course, because my I, I run heretics in here. As well, because they work pretty nicely with uh, missile cards, because I'm using level 8 dragons. And missiles card and uh, heretics or blue eyes deck synergize pretty well. But I think. This variant I created is pretty much the best one for them. At least that's how, how, how I feel. Let's set the Mystic Fate phone and end my turn. My opponent is playing 60 cards in the deck. So it seems like I'm playing against a pretty bad opponent. Or will it surprise me? Put on Veil. I think that's fine. Shuffles three light ones to the hand, then adds um, one to three level four level light monster from the deck. It's, it, mm, same name. So I'm going to get a bad Constellar deck. So I definitely won't play Photon Rail in the deck. Because it's pretty terrible. Because for Xyz, it's it Rock Champion Excalibur. Okay, well, I have to use Spellground to negate the Excalibur's effect. I'm not sure why he's still not close to Battle Phase. Oh, it's honest, and that's does not even work because it's uh, it's Calibur is unaffected by card effects. That's fail. I 
and then go to get mystical spectrophone which means my opponent is now completely out of cards it's mass dragon which is actually a really good card in here because it can help me spell someone my either heretic seal or parsecs on a deck so I can either summon another parsec from my hand or um, use Helios Spirit effect to um, get to a level 8 monster or I can press on the Heretic Seal from the deck and then draw someone asset and then make asset level 8 then go for rank 8 once again but of course this um, deck has a lot of weaknesses like sometimes it's inconsistent because you to uh, draw a um, uh, long wrong combination of uh, cards for example mm -hmm. well I think this is it this stand I just toss my dragon for someone from my hand Vanishing Mass Dragon Then use Darkness Metal effect. Get out Blue Eyes I'm going to No more someone is it Going all in I'm going to summon out Heliopolis and surrender. So, this is it for this 12. I think this is it for this 12 in video. I hope you enjoyed this. And for now, goodbye and Omaha Chaos out.